we've seen it all before, haven't we? We've seen uh, ten years ago with the uh, the polls, people going, oh, bloody polls coming over here, bloody polls coming over here, being all Polish and mending everything. <laughs> coming over here fixing all the stuff we've broken and the too illiterate to read the instructions for doing it better than us in a second language bloody poles coming over here when i was a kid 40 45 years ago it was the indians wasn't it bloody indians pakistanis and indians coming over here inventing us a national cuisine <laughs> Before that, in the 16th century, it's bloody Huguenots, wasn't it? Bloody <laughs> Huguenots coming over here from medieval France. Bloody French religious heretics coming over here, doubting transubstantiation. <laughs> bloody French Huguenots coming over here, questioning the Eucharistic symbolism with their feigned ability to weave little jerkins out of lace. We don't want your lace here. <laughs> We've got corduroy. <laughs> My name's Paul Nuttalls of UKIPS, and I say we need to ensure the brightest and best Huguenots stay in medieval France and concentrate on revising its relationship with the Eucharistic tradition <laughs> instead of coming over here to the UK and teaching us to make hats out of lace. And before them, in the 5th century, it was the Anglo-Saxons, wasn't it? Bloody Anglo-Saxons coming over here from northern continental Europe, the Anglo-Saxons, with their inlaid jewellery <laughs> and their ship burial traditions <laughs> and their miserable epic poetry. Lift Isleyena, with Bithful Arad, Swa Ed Staffa, Ed Staffa de Mindin, Rather, well, shiather, win an aga, hi. If you come over here, Anglo Saxons, not to speak the fucking language. <laughs> My name's Paul Nuttall from UKIP, and I say we need to ensure the brightest and best Anglo Saxons stay in fifth century northern continental Europe <laughs> instead of coming over here to the UK and laying down the basis of our entire future language and culture. <laughs> and before them, 2000 BC, 4000 years ago, is the beaker folk, wasn't it? Bloody beaker folk! The beaker folk coming over here, rowing up the Tagus estuary from the Iberian Peninsula and improvised rats. A bloody beaker folk coming over here with their beakers, with their drinking vessels. What's wrong with just cupping up the water in your hands and licking it up like a cat? My name's Paul Nall from UK, and I say we need to ensure the brightest and best beaker folk stay in the Iberian Peninsula and fill it with beakers <laughs> instead of coming over here to the UK and teaching us to drink liquid out of cups. <laughs> and before them, 4,500 BC, six and a half thousand years ago, the Neolithic people, wasn't it? Bloody Neolithic people. Coming over here from continental Mediterranean Neolithic people. Coming over here with their pictograms <laughs> and their primitive wheat farming innovations and their astrological stone circle temples with all the rocks aligned with the movements of the planets. What's wrong with just worshipping a tree? <laughs> My name's Paul Nuttall of UKIPS and I say we need to ensure the brightest and best Neolithic people Stay in Mediterranean continental. Instead of coming over here to the UK and teaching us to make and eat bread. <laughs> and before them, 400 million years ago, when the first fish crawled up onto the land, our land. <laughs> you get back in the sea, you finned cunt. <laughs> <laughs>